is own your situation. Or if, if you're struggling in your situation, like I was really struggling, and I am still really struggling. I got, I got some hard times ahead of me, um, ahead of me and ahead of my family. So we're, we're going to be struggling, you know. We're going to be going through some emotional battles and stuff like that. But the number one thing you got to remember, the number one thing I'm going to keep telling myself, just like I'm telling you right now while my kids are sitting here listening, because I tell them the same thing, you know. What you're feeling in your hardest struggle is what you allow yourself to feel. You know what I'm saying? Because this world, this world's not easy. The, the life is, your life is not easy. It's not going to be easy. Nobody ever said life was easy. Did they, Gaka? No. No. See, she's right there listening to me. I don't, I don't say anything I say to you guys that I hide from my kids because my kids know me, right? Yeah. So, right, Bianca? Yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> life is going to beat you. Life is going to beat you down. I don't know if anybody's seen the latest Rocky movie, but I love it. Life is going to beat you down. It'll beat you down, and it'll keep you down on the ground, and it'll, it'll just destroy you if you let it. And the only way you can get up, the only way you can get up and not let yourself stay beat down is to own your situation, own your emotions, own your body and your mind. Because if you don't own it and you just let it go and you don't, you don't work on improving it and you just let it go, I mean, I'm going to tell you what, guys, you're going to be depressed for years and years and years and years. I mean, it's not going to be a good life for you. Um, the things that, that affect you and make you depressed, you think other people are doing to you, you've allowed them to control your emotions. And, and you, don't, you should not be letting them, other people, other outside influences control your mind and control your emotions. You should not. Bottom line, you shouldn't. Okay? You've got to be able to control your emotions. And if you need help on that, there's a lot of books that I read. There's a lot of books that I um, recommend. There's videos that I recommend. There's, there's all kinds of stuff that I can re recommend to you. There really is. Um, but the first thing you have to do, the first thing you have to do, you got to grow up. All right? I'm going to say it hard, real, and truthful right now. Grow up. Grow up and own your mind. Own your emotions. Because nobody affects your emotions unless you let them. Nobody puts you down unless you let them. Nobody puts you in your situation except for yourself. All the problems and struggles you're having in your life is your own fault. You put yourself there. You allowed yourself to get in that situation. I'm accepting that my... I'm accepting my situation, and I'm not doing anything except growing. I'm not doing anything except lifting myself up, lifting my kids up, and growing and living our lives. Because that's our job. That's your job. You cannot, when you get down and when you get sad, you cannot blame it on everybody else. Because 100% truth, right here, right now, it's nobody else's fault except you. All right? Nobody made you lose that job. Nobody made you lose that relationship you had. Nobody made you lose your kids if you lost them. Nobody made you drink. Nobody made you do drugs. Nobody did except you. You made the bad decision to do it. All right? You made the bad decision to do the bad things instead of making the good decision and the hard and do the hard things that's right. Girls, look, I'm talking to my girls right now. Today, um, they had a... Dare, um, dare graduation, and it's exactly what they what they taught them, right? What did you What did they teach you about decisions? Um, about not having drugs. About not having drugs, and they they yeah. said something about decisions. I remember what the yeah. police officer said: make good decisions, right? Yeah. And if you're if you're in a position where you're not sure about what your decision is, what are you supposed to do? Think about it and think about what? Um, what, what you should. What your mom and dad should would tell you to do, yeah. right? Oh yeah, yeah. Yes, because those in those times when you don't know what to do and your stomach's churning and you're you need to sit down and think and count. What was it? Count to five. Yeah, yeah. Count, count to five. five. Yeah. 
10 to 5. That's what, they, that's what the police officer, I guess, in their D.A.R.E. program told them to do, which I think is great for kids. If you're, in a, if you're about to make a decision and it's something in your stomach that doesn't feel right, count to five, think about what your, what your parents should do. But all you adults, adults out there listening, guys, you can't be thinking about what adults or, or your parents are going to tell you to do or what other people would tell you to do. Bottom line is, grow up. Hard truth, grow up and do what you're supposed to do. Do the right thing and own your situation because you are where you're at. You put yourself where you're at.